Are you tired of applying for remote jobs just to figure out that the company is no longer hiring a few days or weeks later? Well, you're not the only one. All of these people that I've helped to get remote jobs were tired of the same things as well. And after helping thousands of people get remote jobs, my team and I know the exact companies that are always hiring and pay really well. And by the end of this video, you are gonna know those exact companies as well. That's right, we're talking about companies that are always hiring and paying top dollar for your skills. And it's kind of like finding the holy grail, but instead of eternal life, you get eternal pajama days. Now, before we dive in, let me tell you about my story. I'm Shane, and not too long ago, I was your typical nine to five warrior, battling rush hour traffic and living for the weekend. But then one day I ran into a guy at a local Starbucks who was working remote, and he basically told me that he traveled all the time and he only had to work like 10 to 20 hours per week. And he made $200,000 a year. And that completely changed my perspective of work. And then in the next few years throughout the pandemic, pandemic, a lot of people started working remote and I was one of them. And after I got a taste of working remote, for instance, I went to Puerto Rico with my best friend, John, and I was working remote while I did that. And I had the absolute time of my life. And I met a bunch of other people who were also working remote. I decided I was going to dedicate my time to helping others work remote as well. And now I get to travel the world, live my dream life. I work remote and I help others do the same thing. So whether you're stuck in a cubicle farm like I was, or you're just tired of your cat judging your unemployment, this video is going to be for you. We're going to be exploring 10 and companies that are always on the hunt for remote talent. We're talking anything from customer service champions to tech savvy superstars and everything in between. So grab your favorite beverage, get comfy, and let's dive into this list of remote work gold mines. Right after you gently tap that like button, of course. First up, we've got Conduent. Now, I know what you're thinking, Cond who it? But trust me, this company is a big deal in the customer service world. And they are always on the lookout for customer service rock stars who can turn angry callers into happy campers. So if you've got the patience of a saint and you can type faster than a caffeinated cheetah, this might be your jam. And the best part, you can do all of this from your couch, in your pajamas, with your cat as your coworker. Now, the good thing about getting into a job like this is it's actually incredibly easy to land these jobs. In fact, some clients I've worked with, depending on the state you live in, or the country you live in can land these jobs before they even turn 18 years old. Now, the downside is the earning potential is a bit low. Usually you're going to be making somewhere around 36 to $50,000 a year, depending on your role and your experience. Now we're going to go through a really quick guide to landing the job. You want to polish your resume first of all. So highlight any type of customer service experience you've ever had. And when I say any experience, I literally mean any experience, whether you were paid or not. And there are so many customer service or customer service type jobs or gigs out there that you should be able to easily get some experience. Did you sell hot dogs one time for your uncle's hot dog stand? That's customer service experience. Have you ever answered the phone for you, your family, or someone else's business? That's also customer service experience. Then you want to go ahead and practice your phone voice. And yes, this is a thing. No, this is Patrick. And then you want to be ready to showcase your problem solving skills in the interview. And you want to show enthusiasm for helping people, right? It's really good to be a people pleaser in this type of position, even when they're grumpy. And then when it comes to finding the jobs, you of course want to head over to Conduent Careers and they've got a whole section dedicated to work from home positions. And of course there are a lot of customer service related positions, but they also hire for other positions as well. And they're pretty much always hiring and the pay is decent for entry level remote work. So for this one, I'm going to go ahead and give it a solid eight out of 10 opportunity score. I know you probably don't want to work in customer service your entire life, but if you need to get a job, this is a super easy way to get one, get your foot in the door working for certain types of companies, and then you can move up into better positions later on down the line. So now let's conduct ourselves to the next company on the list. See what I did there? No. Okay, moving on. Next, we've got Working Solutions. And no, this is not a support group for workaholics. Working Solutions is all about providing customer service and sales support for a variety of industries. They're like the Swiss army knife of remote work, basically. So if you're a chameleon who can adapt to different brands and industries faster than you can say, how may I help you? This might be your calling. And so in these positions, you'll be the voice of reason, the problem solver, and sometimes the digital shoulder to cry on for customers. Now, the pay is usually per minute on the phone or per project with the potential to be 15 to $30 per hour. And a quick guide to landing the job is first, you wanna showcase your versatility and the ability to learn quickly. Then you wanna highlight any sales or customer service experience that you have. Then you wanna demonstrate your home office setup and reliability. And you wanna show your ability to work independently and manage your time. And then when it comes to finding jobs, you of course go to workingsolutions.com and then you wanna click on their become an agent section. And then you'd go ahead and apply and it's a pretty straightforward process. This one I'm gonna 
to give an 8.5 out of 10. It's flexible work. There's a variety of different projects, but income can fluctuate. If you go for a sales type position, then that's probably going to be a little bit better, but it's also a little bit harder to land and it's more demanding. Speaking of versatile skills, let me tell you about Kyle McGuire. Kyle was a union tradesman who wanted more from his career. Then he discovered a type of sales, which is tech sales. And in just three months while working full time, he completed the course and he was able to get a job. And the results, Kyle went from earning 50 to 55K per year in his first tech sales job to now making six figures as an inside sales representative and all remotely. And I actually did an interview with him on the channel. It was awesome. And if you're interested in seeing how he was able to do this, go ahead and click on the free training, which I'll put down in the description and the pinned comment below that will tell you all about what tech sales is, how to get into it, and the different types of tech sales roles, as well as if they're good or not for your personality. So next, we're going to be shifting gears to UPS. Now, before you start wondering if you'll need to wear those iconic brown shorts at home, relax. UPS has plenty of remote customer service positions available, and you'll be the voice on the other end of the line, helping people track down their packages and navigate shipping logistics. And it's kind of like being Santa's helper, but instead of toys, you're delivering peace of mind. And the earning potential here is usually going to be about thirty-six to $50,000 per year with potential for overtime during busy seasons. All of these companies that I've mentioned do hire for other positions, but I'm kind of mentioning the easiest ones to get into in this video. But with that being said, definitely check out their other positions as well. And a quick guide to landing the job, you want to highlight any previous customer service or logistics experience. You want to be prepared to showcase your problem solving skills. You want to demonstrate patience and the ability to stay calm under pressure. And you want to show enthusiasm for helping people, even when they're frantically looking for their lost package. And in order to find a job, you want to head over to UPS careers and filter for remote positions. Now for this one, I'm going to go ahead and give it a 7.5 out of 10 because it is steady work, but it can be stressful during peak seasons. Now let's package up this segment and deliver ourselves to the next company on our list, which is going to be Sattel Group. And no, this is not a group of people sitting around telling each other to sit. Sattel is a global leader in customer experience management. In other words, they are the pros at keeping customers happy. And if you've got the gift of gab and you can charm the socks off anyone, this might be your calling. And you'll be handling customer inquiries for some of the biggest brands out there. So it's kind of like being a brand ambassador, but in your sweatpants. Now the earning potential here is probably going to be about 25 to $45,000 per year with potential for performance bonuses. And like I said before, there's a lot of other jobs you can apply for. I'm just showing you the easiest ones to land. Now a quick guide to landing the job is you want to highlight any previous customer service experience that you have. Of course, you want to showcase your ability to multitask because you'll be juggling multiple platforms. Then you want to demonstrate your tech savviness because you'll be using various different types of software. And then you want to show your adaptability because you might be handling different brands on different days. So overall, I'm going to go ahead and give this one a nine out of 10 opportunity. I think there's lots of opportunities and room for growth. And yeah, this one's really solid. Now let me sit tell you about our next company, which is going to be Allstate. Now, if you've ever wanted to be a superhero who swoops in to save the day after someone's fender bender, this is your chance. Allstate is always on the hunt for remote customer service reps and insurance agents. And you'll be helping people navigate the confusing world of insurance, all while sitting in your favorite chair. But just remember, the only mayhem you'll be dealing with is when your cat decides to walk across your keyboard during a call. Now, the earning potential here is somewhere between thirty-six dollars and $50,000 a year. However, with insurance type positions, there is a lot of room for growth and opportunities to move up the ladder and make even more money. Now, a quick guide to landing the job, uh, you want to go ahead and get your insurance license if it applies for the position that you're applying for or the state that you are going to be living in. And usually it's not too hard to do that. You also want to brush up on your sales skills and you want to also be ready to explain complex concepts in simple terms. Plus, you want to show your compassionate side. You'll be dealing with people in stressful situations. Now, of course, in order to find a job, you want to check out the Allstate Careers section and they've got a whole section for remote opportunities. But overall, I really like this one. I think there's room for a lot more growth than some of the other ones. I'm going to give this one a nine out of 10 opportunity score. And the next company on the list is going to be Kaplan. And this is going to be for you smarty pants out there because Kaplan is always on the lookout for brainiacs to join their team. So if you've got knowledge to share and you love the idea of shaping young minds or older minds, we don't discriminate. Kaplan might be your perfect match. It could be tutoring students, creating course materials, or even teaching online classes. So there's opportunities for part-time, full-time, and freelance type work on the platform. And it's kind of like being a professor, but without the tweed jacket and elbow patches. And the earning potential here is typically going to be thirty-six to $54,000 per year, depending on your role and your subject expertise. So a quick guide to landing the job is you're going to be highlighting your educational background and any teaching experience that you might have. That's going to really set you apart. And by the way, if you tutored somebody one weekend, that does count as teaching experience. Then you want to be prepared to showcase your communication skills. Then you want to demonstrate patience 
patience and the ability to explain complex concepts simply. And you want to show enthusiasm for continuous learning because let's face it, you're going to be learning a lot too. Now, in order to find a job, you want to head over to the Kaplan career section, and then you want to filter for remote positions. Now, I really like this one because there's a lot of flexible hours and just flexibility in how you can get paid in general. And there's also pretty good pay. So I'm going to give this one a 9.5 out of 10 opportunity score. And one of the big reasons is I think it's incredibly satisfying to just help other people succeed. And that's why I put together free resources like the guides on how to get a remote job, which I'll put down in the description in the pinned comment below, which is completely free. Now let's educate ourselves about the next company on our list, which is going to be Cambium Learning Group. If Kaplan is the cool professor, Cambium is the innovative ed tech startup that's disrupting the classroom. And they're always on the hunt for educators who can create engaging digital content and virtual learning experiences. And it's kind of like being Bill Nye the science guy, but for every subject and without the bow tie, unless that's your thing, no judgment here. And a Cambium content creator once told me, I have never thought I'd be using memes to teach history, but here I am making learning lit AF. Just kidding, nobody ever told me that, but I thought it was funny. And a quick guide to landing the job is, first of all, you wanna showcase your teaching experience and subject expertise. And I use experience very lightly here, guys. Then you wanna highlight any experience with educational technology. Then you wanna be prepared to demonstrate your creativity in making learning engaging. And then you wanna show your adaptability to new technologies and teaching methods. So in order to find a job, check out Cambium Learning Careers. They've got a variety of remote positions available, and you basically just go to the main page and then you click on careers and you're there. And yeah, I really like this one. Uh, there's great pay, innovative work, and the chance to shape the future of education. I'm going to go ahead and give this one an 8.5 out of 10 opportunity score. Now let's change the subject and move on to our next company. And that is going to be Multiplan. And no, it's not a company that helps you juggle multiple Netflix accounts. Multiplan is a healthcare technology company that's always on the lookout for remote customer service reps and healthcare specialists. Now, if you've got a knack for navigating the maze of healthcare and insurance, this might be your calling. So you'll be helping healthcare providers and patients make sense of billing and coverage. It's like being a healthcare hero, minus the scrubs and long hospital shifts. And the earning potential here is usually about $36 to $50,000 per year, depending on your role and experience. So a quick guide to landing the job is to of course highlight any healthcare or insurance experience then you want to showcase your attention to detail because those medical codes are no joke and then you want to demonstrate your ability to explain complex concepts simply and you want to be able to show empathy and patience because you'll be dealing with people in very stressful situations so there's a lot of different random healthcare related jobs that I talk about all the time out there and many of them believe it or not are actually remote and the place you can go to find these jobs with this particular company is you basically head over to the multi-plan careers page and you filter for remote positions. So with this one, I really do like it, but it kind of does require a little bit of healthcare experience in many cases. So if you don't have healthcare experience, this might not be the best one for you. So for that reason, I'm going to go ahead and give it a seven out of 10 opportunity score. But if you do have healthcare experience, this one is excellent. Now let's diagnose our next company on the list, which is going to be RKD Group. And no, it's not a boy band from the 90s. RKD Group is a marketing agency that specializes in nonprofit fundraising. And they're always on the lookout for remote marketers and social media gurus. And if you've got a way with words and you can make people whip out their credit cards faster than you can say donate, this might be your jam. Because you're gonna be helping worthy causes raise money and awareness. It's like being a superhero, but instead of a cape, you wear a headset and type really fast. Now the earning potential here is gonna be 40 to $70,000 per year, depending on your role and experience. And a quick guide to landing the job, uh, you wanna showcase your marketing experience, especially in digital and social media. You also wanna highlight any experience with nonprofits or fundraising, which by the way, it's super easy to volunteer for nonprofits. Then you want to be prepared to demonstrate your creativity and ability to tell compelling stories. And then you want to show your passion for making a difference because it's not just about the money here. And the place you'd go to find jobs is you'd want to check out RKD group careers page, and they've got a variety of remote positions available. So the opportunity score here, you know what, this one's pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and give it an 8.5 out of 10 opportunity score. There's good pay, meaningful work, and the chance to flex your creative muscles. Speaking of flex, flexing your creative muscles for all of you who have made it this far in the video. And if you've ever dreamed of starting your own YouTube channel, I've got something special for you. I've got a free crash course resource on how to grow and make money on YouTube, which I'm going to put down in the description and the pinned comment below. It's completely free and it gives away the most important secrets that I have gathered over the last few years growing this YouTube channel to multiple six figures per month. So definitely don't miss out on this because I don't know how many I'm going to be giving away. Check it out in the description, the pinned comment below. Now let's continue our journey through the 
the land of remote work opportunities. Up next, we've got Found Ever. And no, it's not a new type of prehistoric glue. Found Ever is all about customer experience. They're basically the wizards behind the curtain for many big brands. And you'll be the voice of reason in a world of, I'd like to speak to your manager, chaos. Call your supervisor, please. Now the earning potential here is really good for a customer service type position at 30 to $60,000 per year, depending on your role and experience. And there's not just customer service positions, but you also have sales positions as well. And a little secret here is a lot of customer service positions out there are secretly actually sales positions because many of them you actually get bonuses if you end up upselling the person to a higher level product. And uh, <laughs> that's something the companies don't want you to know. But anyways, let's move on. Quick guide to landing the job. You wanna highlight any customer service or sales experience you have. You want to showcase your ability to stay calm under pressure. You also want to demonstrate your tech savviness because you'll be using various different platforms. And then you want to show your enthusiasm for helping people even when they're not enthusiastic themselves. And the place you want to find jobs is you'd want to go to jobs.foundever.com. And they basically got a smorgasbord of different remote positions available. So with this one, uh, it's not quite as good for beginners because they really do expect you to have like top tier customer service ability. But with that being said, if you're already in customer service and you want to upgrade to something where you might get paid more, this one might be great for you. But I'm assuming most people don't have that. So I'm going to give this one a 7.5 out of 10 opportunity score. Now, these companies are very high paying for entry level positions. But if you want to see companies that are almost always hiring and they pay higher, a lot of the time they're not super entry level positions. I did make a video on that and it went viral. People absolutely loved it. And you can check that out by clicking right here.